Hi and welcome to Just One More Puzzle. Today I'll be reviewing a new set of dryer trousers that I got for Christmas. So I've been using them for about five months and I'm pretty sure they are the best thing I've ever bought for puzzling. So, here are my dry trousers. The sea kayakers among you will recognise the name Reed Chill Cheetah. So that's where these are from. Um, they're made from a proprietary material called Aquatherm, so if you go on the Reed website, the link for which is provided with, with this video, um, you'll be able to see that they're called Aquatherm dry trousers. So they're quite different um, from other dry trousers on the market. I'm probably preaching to the converted here, but we all know that we often launch our paddle boards, kayaks or canoes by wading into water. And when it gets really, really cold by November, December, we start to get cold feet. We don't really want to wear just our neoprene socks and boots and dry trousers are that ultimate luxury that we as paddlers can have on the water. So having dry trousers with socks is a really nice option for paddlers who get cold quite easily or those who want to paddle through the winter. And dry trousers with socks particularly allow us to layer thermals underneath while paddling in very cold environments. You can see the trousers, they're a bit different because they've got a salad pack design and they have got socks, which I'll come to in a second. Um, there's a fleece lining inside which keeps you warm, um, but I often wear thermals underneath as well. So when do I use these? Well, clues in the name, I tend to wear these trousers all through winter and possibly up to April, May when the water is still cold and uh, because I launch pretty much all my craft by wading in, my feet are the first things to get wet and I don't necessarily want them to be cold on a long paddle uh, on a chilly day, so these are a lifesaver. So I'm happy to tell you that the base cost of these trousers is £93.5 um, and these trousers uh, come without socks so if you want to add socks on it's an extra £7.50 for both sets uh, which is easily added when you're uh, on the website so do take a look at the link provided. Uh, you can also add a front relief zip for about £27.90 I believe. And uh, for a, only a little bit more, you can have these trousers made to measure, which is um, a really, really handy option. So here they are. Um, I just want to mention that these aren't designed specifically for women's bodies. Um, so they're either designed really to fit men or sort of gender neutral. Uh, saying that, the size guide on the website is no different to one I've seen before. So a size medium kind of fit to my body's measurements and it fits perfectly. You'll notice it looks nothing like other dry trousers, so it sits quite snug on the body. Um, and there's actually a lot of advantages to having that. It's also worth saying that the socks can come absolutely matching to your foot size, which is really unlike other dry trousers. So the socks on these trousers fit me like a glove and I don't need to size up on shoes which is something that you have to do on other dry trousers that are available on the market. Uh, so it's really worth considering um, these trousers just for that reason. So the fit for me is unbelievable. There's hardly any uh, trapped air because it's quite a snug fit um, and the straps can be adjusted. So I wear them quite tight for pedal boarding, but for seated sports, they, I find that they dig in, so they need to be a bit loose. Um, this area under the bust doesn't uh, chafe or snag anywhere and it's not uncomfortable because there's still quite a lot of room there. I really, really like these trousers, mainly because the material is so flexible and stretchy. Question on everybody's mind when we buy a new pedaling kit is whether it'll look good. To be honest, I really like the way these look and it's quite rare for me to find pedaling kit flattering. Uh, I know this is a fitted, kind of fitted um, option and it's not for everyone, so if you prefer loose clothing, do bear that in mind. Uh, I personally prefer the more fitted um, feeling, just because I feel like I can actually move without feeling like there's quite a lot of stuff moving around. 
in terms of feeling um i think i've hinted this a few times i really love these trousers these are so much better than the other dry trousers that i've had in the past not just because of the fit um i, I do not like baggy trousers see paddle borders i don't know if you'll agree with this but having baggy dry trousers is really a hindrance for my paddling uh, when in when i'm in big waves so i find these really really much more comfortable and having socks that fit to your feet is amazing so i don't have to size up and get massive shoes again for paddle boarding having massive shoes is a big problem and i'll cover that in a different video but these trousers are a game changer for me so how could these trousers be better well um maybe a women's specific size guide wouldn't be the worst thing especially since there are lots of women doing water sports now um, so I, I would really like to see that in future. But other than that, the design is absolutely amazing. The fit is really good. Um, I have tried this system with a dry top and done quite a lot of rescues. And I do get wet after the fifth roll. Um, so it's worth bearing in mind that it doesn't quite work in the same way as a semi-dry top and dry trousers from other brands might. Uh, but again, if you're not doing rescue practice, this is actually fabulous. So the thing I appreciate most in these trousers, apart from all the other things I appreciate, is uh, the material. So the material is proprietary, so Reed are the only ones who have this kind of aqua fleece material. The best thing is that when you get off the water and you're absolutely soaking wet, you can wipe them and they're dry. It doesn't take a day or two days or however long your other dry trousers take to dry because these are wipeable so i can go on an expedition with just these trousers and i don't have to worry so to conclude these dry trousers are amazing the material is really quick to dry there's a fleece lining the socks can be uh, matched to your shoe size so you don't have to size up on shoes um they're not very expensive which is really rare for pedaling kit and they're made in the uk uh, which is also brilliant so we're supporting our local businesses um so yeah these are definitely my most versatile and favorite bit of kit at the moment i hope that review was helpful to anybody who might be looking for dry trousers or maybe looking for uh, an upgrade to their current dry uh, or semi-dry system Reed Chill Cheetah have been in the business for a really long time. They've been creating kits specifically for sea kayaking for years, but that doesn't mean we can use we can't use it for other paddle sports. So I really encourage you to um, have a look at the link that I've provided next to the video. Have a look at the trousers. Um, I'm not getting any money from this, by the way, um, but these are absolutely amazing, uh, and I would love for others to have the same experience and better quality kit while paddling. So if you enjoyed this video, please like it, please share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to Just One More Paddle.